So, like most people, I woke up today and I thought, let's give away $500. It was the logical thing to do, so that's what I've decided to do. I don't know why, but we're gonna do it, okay? I've come up with an idea of how we're going to give it away. By making it a competition. Now on my Minecraft server, mc.beanblocks.com. We've done competitions in the past where they're always building competitions. These normally take a long time and you've actually got to be talented at building to win. Whereas I wanted everyone to have a chance at winning this money. So I went on my survival server and I teleported to a random location and built a tower. And the only way you can win the $500 is to find me. It's really that simple. Now, we've got a pretty big server, so it should take quite a while for someone to find us. However, on my server, some people have the ability to fly, so they might have a slight advantage of being able to clear the area quicker. Let's head onto the server now, and let's give away $500. And hey, if this video does well, I might just do this again in the future, so make sure to subscribe, and also make sure to check out mc.bblocks.com. Let's cut to the tower. So here I am, completely in the wild, in my survival server. I'm in vanish mode currently, which means nobody knows I'm here. As you can see on my second account, which I'm here on, I am not there. Also, I don't appear on the list of players. So this is the tower I have built. It's very basic, nothing too crazy. I just wanted it to sort of like stand out a little bit, so I put all the gold blocks on there. And of course in the center is my skull on the diamond block. First person to take the skull will win the $500. And I've checked this area for like signs of life and I couldn't find any. I'm pretty far out at the moment. I went around the entire area, sort of like there's a little bit here of someone chopping down some trees, but apart from that, no sign whatsoever of any life. Like all the caves and stuff, no torches anywhere, just lava. So I think everyone should have a pretty equal chance of finding me and once they find me wait what's this I i've just found this here empty chest little wooden hut what <laughs> this wasn't here before either way there's no actual players near me so hopefully it'll take a while for someone to find me fingers crossed at least oh gosh what if someone finds me in like three minutes five hundred dollars and the video is gonna be like four minutes long god i hope that doesn't happen but let's switch back to my main account now as we are going to inform people all across the server what is happening right now we have 81 people online on survival one let's head to some other servers and tell them quickly honestly this is kind of scary this is quite a big deal but i guess we should get the process rolling oh okay Put the message there, do it in creative server as well, and do it in factions. And then let's head back to survival where we will unvanish. As you can see, some people are starting to join. So as you can see, a few more people have joined right now. Okay, so here's the deal. I'm hiding somewhere on the map with my skull. The first person to find and break my skull gets $500 sent to their bank, bank and PayPal. Good luck and go. So, people should start coming looking for me. And now I can switch to my other account where you can see me chilling here with my skull and let's see if anyone can find me. He is, is he at spawn? He, I'm not at spawn, I'll tell you that right now. But I'm gonna teleport to spawn on my other account, see if there's anybody here. Oh gosh, there's a lot of people. So let's start searching the map, see if we can find anyone. But the first person obviously to find me wins. Joel accept my friend request, I'm not accepting anyone's friend request. Guys, you have to find me. Also, it may look occasionally on this screen like there's people underneath me. Those are not people, those are mobs. They have little things above their name. All right, let's see if we can find anybody in the area. It's gonna fly around, but I'm pretty sure it's gonna be quite tricky to even spot someone, because we are 9,000 blocks away from spawn, I'm pretty sure. Oh my God, I found Joel. No, you didn't. Stop lying, Luca. You didn't find me. Okay, let's see if we can find anyone. There's now 130 people and we got 50 people from the other servers to come around. And the thing is, on this server, there's random warps. So you can warp and it will just teleport you randomly somewhere in the world, which is what I did to find this. So someone will have to get really lucky with a warp. Maybe that might be the best way to find me. So I've just said on my main account, just find me. That's all I'm on the surface. Lots of people thought I was at spawn. That's not the case. Why would I be at spawn? <laughs> people would find me instantly. I'm not gonna tell people to buy them, but I'll say, I won't tell you biome, but I'm in a gold tower. Good luck. And let's teleport my second account. Wait, what? H how has someone found me already? What? No way. What? How have they found me already? <laughs> how have they found me so quickly? That... 
$500 that quick. Um, let's switch to my main account. <laughs> what the heck? I, guys, I just, I thought this would, t I was like, oh, preparing for like 45 minutes. This was going to take, it's, it's been five minutes, not even joking. <laughs> um, I guess we can interview them kind of. I'll ask them. I said, how did you find me so quickly? Let's see what they said. I just have no idea. I just did slash wild and flew around and they found me that quickly. Quickly. OMG, lol. <laughs> well, uh, right. Let's ask their details. I'm not going to put this on screen. I'm doing all the communicating through Minecraft signs. This was a bit ridiculous. Moonchilds, um, yeah, congrats to Moonchilds. They're, they're currently sending me their information so I can send them the $500 and I'll show you the receipt of me doing so. Like, honestly, I thought it was going to take at least 30 minutes, but no, they said they just got really lucky and they just walked randomly and then they got teleported to here. That is insane. Honestly, that's the quickest I've ever spent $500 in my life. <laughs> Don't know what to think. And there we go. It's done. Although you can't see whose the email it is, but trust me, I've sent it. Oh man, I can't believe I did that. Five minutes. I, I, it's, right, well, what I said at the start of this video. Now, We've got a pretty big service, so it should take quite a while for someone to find us. Yeah, um, I was hoping it'd take like 45 minutes for people to find me, but no, five minutes. If you do the maths, it's not that hard. $100 per minute. That's what I just spent there. That, that, uh, yeah, I'll probably do this again in the future, but I'll make it a little bit harder for people to find me. For example, I could go underground or in the sky, etc. But for now, how about I show you some of the awesome builds that we have on this server? We've got a really good community and there's some amazing projects that people are doing. And you can come look at this too if you come to the server, mc.beanblocks.com. And maybe in the future, you'll be online when I do the next $500 competition. So here... We have the staff village with all the staff in it who, oh my gosh, look at this place. It looks massive. Let's have a look around, shall we? We've got an awesome looking house being worked on over here. Oh my gosh. These mushrooms look awesome. Oh my days. Look at this house. I love people's build styles. Like everyone always has different build styles. This one's nuts. The interior everything about it. And I love how they've integrated the mushroom into it. What the heck? And it's like open top. That is an awesome looking house. We got, oh my gosh, look at this place as well. There's so many cool builds. And the thing is, this server's on 1.12.2 at the moment. People's builds are like the 1.12.2 blocks are nuts. Look how cool this place looks. All these little things. Got another little house over here. Look at this place, the blue mushroom. Ooh, I like this, the little hobbit hole as well. Very cool. This mushroom over here looks really awesome. I love the build styles on these houses. Very nice. Oh, and the bees, that's so cute. This is inspiring for me for like building on X Life. I wanna build stuff like this in the future. It looks awesome. Mine and Lizzie's area looks like this. I'll be super happy. I really like the trees that they've built. I need to take some notes on these trees. These are awesome looking. Wow, look at this manor that someone's built. This is all survival as well, remember? So you got like some cool builds on here. We've got a pool out back. I love the style. It looks like a real life house. This is mental. Inside, oh, the, the, the thing that I'm jealous of most is people's interior decoration skills. Look at all this cool stuff. Like, who would think to do this? It just looks like an actual in real life house. The motorbike, it's epic. It, sorry, but how do people do this? This is so cool. We've got Arctic Wolf here who has a very nice beach resort. What the heck is all this redstone for? Holy chest system. Look how much sand and stuff that they must have used. This is what you guys are missing out. You should come play on mc.beanblocks today. Make some friends. Build some cool stuff together. If you've got a copy of Minecraft, then you're missing out. Someone says they've built Lizzie's Disney castle. Oh my God, yeah, look. What the heck? Someone's actually built <laughs> Lizzie's Disney castle from Crazy Craft. That's awesome. Have they decorated the interior? Oh my gosh, that's adorable. I love that. Some llamas back here. What's up here? I hear cats. Whoa, what the heck? <laughs> Holy mansion. People are really like into these mansion designs on the server. I didn't realize. Look at all this crazy stuff. This is still being decorated. Look at this like indoor garden. Oh, this is adorable. An indoor garden. I've not really thought of doing that before. That looks very cute. Why is there a creeper here? So Luca here has built Bikini Bottom in Minecraft. Look at this place. Oh my gosh. We've got the chum bucket. Oh, we've got... Oh, this is so cool. Even Noodle Bob Squarepants is here. Wow. 
<gasps> Look at that. That's so cool. Is this map art? Holy moly. That's awesome. And we got the crusty crab over here as well. Wow, this is really cool. Whoa, look at this place as well. What? Oh my gosh, this looks awesome. Wait, and someone said in here, look at these skeleton skulls. That's an awesome skull. I like that. They're telling me to come upstairs. Whoa, look at this place. Oh, I love the parrots and the lampshade up there. This whole place looks awesome. What? I'm truly jealous. Like, honestly, this is some nuts. Oh, they've got the pride flags up, it looks like, as well. Oh my goodness. This is actually insane. Look at this cactus farm I've just found. It's the most insane thing. Is this the storage for it? What the heck? Oh no, this is a mob farmer. It's funny, you've got like this little medieval village here and then on the other side there's this just insane cactus farm. Industrial revolution taking over. And those are just a few of the builds that you can find. There's a really good community of people making some awesome survival stuff there. But there you have it guys, that's going to be it for this video. Thank you so much for watching, I hope you did enjoy. Make sure to leave a like and comment and subscribe if you haven't already and I shall see you another time. Goodbye.